Oh, should we start this show? Yeah, I'm down. Just buying a car in Carvana first. Oh, for real? Yeah, it's super convenient. I already got pre-qualified in two minutes. All I had to do is answer a few questions. Ooh, that's helpful. And now just customizing my down and monthly payments. Oh, that's a very fair deal. Yep. Boom. Just bought a car. And you get to take me to the Carvana vending machine in a couple days to pick it up. Ooh. I'm kind of busy. Visit Carvana.com to finance your next car. Financing subject to credit approval. Hey, 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 welcome back, welcome back, everyone. It is officially the first episode of Season 2 of 10 Minutes to Talk, and I'm your host, Jim Lillari, a.k.a. Nina Capone, for some of you who may know me that way. And today we are diving into a hot topic that's been the core of my consulting work in 2024, okay? I know we are only a few, well, a month and some change in, but hey, the challenge of correcting misinformation learned from social media has been killing me, okay? So I want to talk about it today. So in this digital age, and I'm not going to waste a whole bunch of time. Y'all know we only got 10 minutes, so we want to get it popping and get it moving right now. So in this digital age, social media is a double-edged sword, okay? It's a treasure trove of instant knowledge, but unfortunately, also a breeding ground for misinformation. As a consultant, I've seen firsthand the conflict this creates with people who come to me and say, hey, you know, um, I was watching this on TikTok. TikTok is like the core of it. Um, I was watching this on Instagram. I heard about this on Facebook. Um, and, and it's the beliefs of businesses and business practice about uh, self-improvement and you know, they don't know if it's real or fake, but they want to try it or they've tried it and lost money or what have you. So this year, I officially have taken a new approach. It's no longer <laughs> just about offering advice, okay? It's also about curating my clientele. Um, I did find that I wasted a lot of time dealing with the people who were more to, to to listen to social media than, you know, a paid consultant, someone that you're paying uh, to research and provide proper resources, um, you have to go to social media. And that's cool. Just leave me out of it, right? So at this point in time, I'm looking for those who are not just seeking a change, but are truly ready for it, you know? So we're looking for people who are really ready to challenge you know, what they've learned online and rebuild their foundations on a, a solid sexual ground, you know. Um, we're, we're really looking for those who who ready to get into it. So this brings me to something I'm incredibly excited about. And I wanted to share it with you all today since this is the first episode and I've been extremely overwhelmed and busy <laughs> since October of last year, and I want to tell you guys, I created a, a six-week hustle and hack consulting program with an accompanying workbook. So this isn't just another course I'm past that as well. This is a transformative journey designed to help you sift through the noise, debunk the myths, and harness the true potential of well-informed strategies and hacks that genuinely work okay um i've thought about doing a course and it's may be considered a course if you want to look at it that way but it's a little more to it than that so um yeah we're actually looking and curating our clientele at this point we want to find those who are really ready and we do this through a discovery call um a meetup first to make sure that this is, you know, we all can, we can work together. Okay. The program is built on three pillars where we clarify, strategize, and implement. Um, I'm not a big believer in reading to you or giving you a bunch of information and hoping you go do it. Um, try that. Try to give advice. Notice that people don't get it done. I need for you to get it done. I want to see people succeed. I want to hold your hand and get you to the end. So first we 
we clarify the misconceptions you've already encountered. Okay, you, you're going to come in with information um, on what you think you know, what you might know, what you've already tried, what you failed at, what somebody told you, what somebody else is doing. But each business is different, and we have to have our own personalized strategy. So from there, once we, we debunk all of the, the nonsense and clear your head, then we strategize by laying down a plan that's tailored, okay, to your goals. So we're going to, again, debunk the social media myths one by one, okay? You you like this this thing that you learned. Let's get into it the real way. Let's, let's look at how we can go at it and make it work for your niche, okay? So that's what we do. Finally, the implement phase. We put our plan, that plan of action, those strategies we come up with, we put them into action, okay? Navigating the path towards your success with precision and truth is the key, okay? We want to make sure we put put our money where our mouth is, right? We want to make sure that we are ready to take it to the next level by putting the action in place. And, you know, and I've worked with several people just kind of um, testing out this my, my new strategy and what I found was, you know, people would come in and get started and they have one objective, one goal in mind, and they'll they'll go off into three others, you know, and I kind of just watched and I wanted to see how it would go. But all I see is they don't actually complete anything because they're they're selling themselves short trying to do too many things at one time. So this program is very focused. It's very focused on what you what the goal is. And we don't move on. I don't want to hear about what you're working on, your other ideas, other people that you're working on. I don't care about any of that because at the core, we're focusing on getting one thing done, completed, launched, put out there, and you making some money. Because at the end of the day, this is about profit optimization. If you're not making any money, what are you doing, right? So once we get all of those things rolling, that implementation process is is really, really the core of the program, us getting things in place and getting it done. So within that six-week period, you're not wasting time. You're not going to do a one-year course. You're not taking an eight-month. Listen, six weeks. And if you are lucky enough to catch me during the four-hour workshops or conferences that we'll be doing coming up, um, then you'll get all of this in one shot, kind of, kind of. But you know, the six weeks allows you to work with me one-on-one, -on -one, and we tackle each and every obstacle together. So it's about more than just business. It's about fostering a mindset that questions, verifies, and seeks truth before acceptance. I'm going to say that again. It's about fostering a mindset that questions, verifies, and seeks truth before acceptance. This means I don't need you online just watching something like, yeah, this is it, this is it. I mean, because a lot of times people are giving you some of the truth, but they're not telling you the backstory or what you have to do to get there. See, I see a lot of people going out, um, you know, with the business startup, getting the LLC, getting the address, getting the EIN, getting the DUNS number, but then they start the business and, you know, and, oh, no, 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 let me jump into it. They get the loan, they get that $50,000 loan, but they don't know how they're going to pay it back because their business is not working. They're, they don't, they're not, they have no way to make money. They're not making any money to be able to pay that $50,000 loan back. So with that being said, we do not want you to get in that crunch. We do not want you to be stressed out. We do not want you to just be out here randomly taking out loans that you cannot pay because you have no business, no business process, no structure, nothing in place. It's a thought. It's something that you want to do, and that's cool, but let's do it the right way. Um, you know, successful businesses can hire people, and that's one of the big things I want to make sure you guys can do. You can actually have a successful business, not be a freelancer or self-employed. You want to make sure that you can work on the business while other people are working in the business. Let me say that again. You can work on your business while other people are working in your business. That's super important for this journey, okay? So we want to foster that mindset. 
with questions that verifies and seeks the truth before acceptance. This journey has taught me the importance of resilience and adaptability, okay? Not just in business, but in life. As I restructured my business, I restructured my life. I started to question things, okay? So this is not something, this is not a book that I decided to write um, <laughs> just off the top of my head because I thought it was a good title, but this this is from experience. This is something that I've, I've been in business for 14, 16 years. I don't know why I like to say 14, 16 years now. And these are things that I've actually personally experienced. And it's it's just, we're there now. It's time for us to grow as a community of business owners, entrepreneurs, freelancers. It's time for us to get to the next step, okay? Apply what I, what I give you in this program to your life, okay? So, I'm not going to stay on too long. I'm not going to go over my time because this is the premiere launch episode. Don't want to mess it up. So to my listeners, if you're tired of the quick fixes and the false promises that flood your feeds and you're ready to invest in your true potential, the six-week hustle and heck is probably for you. And together, we'll navigate the misinformation minefield and emerge onto the other side not the uncast, uh, but vigorous, hey, we're going to get it done. We're going to make this money. Let's get rich this year. Sorry, no, no, no. We don't want to be there. We want to not be rich this year. We want to be rich forever. We want to go ahead and build wealth. We want to understand where every dollar comes from and how we're implementing it and put it in place. So as we wrap up today's episode, remember, in a world full of noise, the most powerful tool we have is our ability to seek the truth. So I need you guys to stay curious, stay skeptical, and most importantly, stay ready for change, okay? I am going to drop the details of this episode and how to contact me. If you're interested in going through the Hustle and Hack program, you want to find out more about it, we will be launching the advertisements officially next week. But if you're looking to get more information, simply visit my website at mybizconsulting.net and we and just complete the – it's an online form. It's called a discovery call. Complete the discovery call questions, and we'll get that process underway to see if you and I are a match for one another so I can help guide you through this challenge, of this journey of business I want to see you succeed. You want to see you succeed. You got to want to see you succeed for you, not me, but you, right? So, again, this is Jamila Lari, a.k.a. Nina Capone, signing off from today's episode of 10 Minutes of Talk, season two, episode one. Join me next week as we dive deeper into the strategies that can help you overcome misinformation and achieve your dreams. Until then, keep hustling, keep hacking, and keep moving forward. Fargo, the new virtual assistant from Wells Fargo, makes banking faster and easier. Like this. Fargo, what's my checking account routing number? And this. Fargo, uh, turn off my debit card. And this. Fargo, what did I spend on groceries last month? And that's just the beginning. Do you, Fargo? You can in the Wells Fargo mobile app. Learn more at wellsfargo.com slash getfargo. Terms and conditions apply. Your mobile carrier's availability and message and data rates may apply. Wells Fargo Bank and a member of FDIC. Fargo, the new virtual assistant from Wells Fargo, makes banking faster and easier. Like this. Fargo, what's my checking account routing number? And this. Fargo, uh, turn off my debit card. And this. Fargo, what did I spend on groceries last month? And that's just the beginning. Do you, Fargo? You can in the Wells Fargo mobile app. Learn more at wellsfargo.com slash getfargo. Terms and conditions apply. Your mobile carrier's availability and message and data rates may apply. Wells Fargo Bank and a member of FDIC.